I'm joined by Dr Susie Schofield from the University of Dundee. And Susie, you've been working with uh, adults returning to higher education, is that correct, in the context that you work in? Yes, um, I'm involved with the Masters for Medical Education. So that's health professionals who may have just come out of um, their undergraduate course or they may have been working in the health service for some years. So as, as uh, adults returning to higher education, you were specifically working with um, a, a wiki tool, is that correct, to, to focus on the feedback process and, and, and the learning process. Can you tell us a bit about that? Yes, well, we were, we were concerned that maybe we didn't know whether, because we're an online distance learning course, whether our students were engaging with feedback, were they reading it, were they understanding it, were they feeding it forward. So we very much wanted to open a workable dialogue and we felt that the wiki tool was going to be best for that because the university generally uses Blackboard as a virtual learning environment, so we were able to use Campus Pack Wiki. So the Campus Pack Wiki was a, a wiki tool that was actually built into the virtual learning environment? Yes, yeah. So in that way there was no extra login for them, which was very important for us, for adult learners who were at a distance. So I understand that you were considering using the blogging tool within the same Campus Pack within the VLE, but you went for the wiki. What was the purpose of that? Yes. What, was the reason, what were the reasons for that? Yes, the, uh, the blog was very good at just handling a discussion per module, but what we actually wanted was a programmatic look. We very much wanted to get this idea across to them that feedback fed from one assignment to the next, but also from one module to the next. So we wanted them to be able to think of that continuation, but also for our tutors who may only see them for, well, virtually see them for one module to be able to look at previous feedback. So that transition from not being in higher education to coming back to it was the addition of the kind of digital interface. Did it add complexity or did it, did it really enrich things? It certainly added some worries for our students because in the induction I asked them to talk about um, their, their worries as well as their hopes and certainly that was one of the things that came through. The, the distance, the not really feeling that they could have a chat with their tutor or with other uh, people on the course was a worry to them, their technical skills. Also moving from health education to social science of education was, was a concern to some of them. Thank you.